using the mouse to click and drag. We've looked at clicking on icons and how they change color to show you that they are selected. This time we're going to use click and drag to move something from one part of the screen or one part of the computer to a different part. If I move my mouse to the Microsoft Word icon and I click and hold my mouse button down. As soon as I start dragging my mouse, the Microsoft Word icon follows my mouse. So I'm going to drag it all the way to the right hand side of the screen. When I take my finger off the mouse button, the Microsoft Word icon is now on the right hand side of my screen and it's not over the left here where it was a second ago. Now I can do that with any number of icons. I'll do it with the Microsoft Excel icon next. I'll go left click and hold my mouse button down and while my mouse button is down I drag my mouse over to the right hand side of the screen. When it's where I want it to be I take my finger off and there it is. I'll try it with one more. Windows Explorer if I click and hold the mouse button down and drag. Now I'm moving my mouse to the right hand side of the screen but what if all of a sudden I run out of space and I can't move my mouse physically on the desk anymore. There might be a book in the way. It might be the edge of the table. What do you do? Well you won't be able to see it in this video but if I just keep my finger on the left mouse button but lift the mouse in the air I'm now moving it anywhere in the air that I want to as long as my mouse button is still kept down, nothing's going to happen. When I put it back down on the table, I move it obviously to the left a little. All of a sudden I have more space on the right hand side of my mouse, which enables me to move to the right. Then when I take my finger off, that icon will slot into space. I'll do one more with the calculator here. Click, drag, and I can put it exactly where I want it. Take my finger off and it slots into space. This is a very simple example and all you're doing in this example is rearranging the way your desktop looks. If you're thinking that that's all it does, remember that this is just to give you an idea of how to click and drag. When you get to know programs like Microsoft Publisher, Windows Explorer, and any number of other programs, you use the same concept to move a picture from one part of the screen to another part, or to move a file from one folder into another one. So it's very handy. It's called click and drag and it uses the left mouse button.